You got some funny. It's funny, one time I had a lady uh, once say to me, she said, oh my god, you actually make the faces. I was like, how else would they be made? <laughs> uh, uh, do, what, do I have a stunt double? Hey everyone, Joel Hans here. Today we are in Venice, Florida. Yes, Venice, Florida, outside. Crave hot dogs, beer, and barbecue. So here to do their giant Crave challenge, or the ultimate Crave challenge, I think it's called. So this is consisting of what I believe to be 10 hot dogs and five sausages. So this place, obviously well known for their hot dogs, their beer, and their barbecue. Whole bunch of like taps of beer, uh, barbecue being like pulled pork, brisket, probably uh, chicken, I think. And then obviously crazy fancy hot dogs. So all I know about this challenge is it is a 35 minute time limit in order to get the meal for free. I think it's about an 80 or $90 value if we fail. Um, that being said, it has like just a whole variety of different hot dogs. I'm just gonna get like some help to go through this. Guys, I have not slept in now like, I don't know, I didn't base it in sleep last night. Long story short, maybe I'll tell you afterwards, but I had like crazy layovers blah 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 i'm exhausted so yeah i'm my mind's not working 100 percent right now so anyway i'm gonna stop talking let's head in it's fun let's get food Hi everybody so here we are with the ultimate crave challenge guys so the 15 hot dogs and or sausages so i have the 10 classics and i picked the extra five so for the extras i picked two extra chicago dogs two extra memphis dogs which are pulled pork and coleslaw and barbecue sauce and then one a uh, kind of classic bratwurst which is uh, sarkra mustard all right for the other ones that i can't really remember the name because i'm my brain is fried when i have an employee help me out so this is definitely a chili cheese dog yes chili cheese awesome dog. i think it's supposed to be a slaw dog yes. we have what's this one out here that is a nacho dog nacho dog oh yeah nacho chips i see some sour cream cheese tomatoes this is a tater tot dog uh loaded baked Potato dog. Loaded baked potatoes. So tater tots, bacon, sour cream. Yep. Uh, we got the classic bratwurst. That's uh, hot with uh, sauerkraut and yellow mustard. Cool. Uh, what is this one Chili here? cheese. Chili cheese. Yeah. Okay. This is the cooked onions and peppered with mild sausage. Cool. And is this one like the, what they call the dynamic duo? Uh, yeah. Ah, so yeah, this is like a combo pack, I guess you could say. Um, and then we have the mac and cheese dog. What's that one called? Uh, the cheesy mac dog. Cheesy mac dog. Macaroni and cheese, cheese, bacon, and then the other kind of uh, classic bratwurst thing. Thing. All right, I think that's it. There you go, guys. My brain half worked. So go, yeah, go. like I said, 35 minutes, not a lot of time. Go. Definitely a lot of food. So let's get started here just momentarily. I'm definitely ready. I think restaurant is ready. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so thank you everybody who came out, guys. Much appreciated. Thank you guys all for coming out. Thank you so much. You guys can clap at you, don't worry. Um, all right, so I also have all their sauces here. So this place is not only known for their hot dogs, but also their barbecue. And I love all of that stuff. So I got like their sweet and tangy. We got like a Louisiana hot and spicy. Of course I have some ketchup. So I'm pumped. Oh, Kansas City. Oh, all their hot sauces. I have Chipotle hot sauce, habanero, jalapeno. And Beer. I'll probably start with, oof, so many options. Um, I'm gonna boo, 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 boo. Ah, hmm. This, I'm gonna start with one of these uh, Chicago dogs. Love it. I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm so excited to try all these hot sauces and sauces and ketchups. And I love sauces, I love flavors, guys. And I love, I love a mustard barbecue sauce. Let me know your favorite kind of barbecue sauce down below. So, anyway, how do we get started, guys? Say so maybe count of 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Go. Okay. Those little peppers on there. Mm. 
And not hot dog. <laughs> what up? Like, that is a flavorful hot dog. It's very, very um, like rich. Hey everyone, welcome to Zero. Today we're here in Venice. Yes, not Venice, Italy, but Venice, Florida. Doing a giant hot dog and sausage challenge. So super cool. I mean, hey, who doesn't like hot dogs? But let me know down below. Do you prefer a hot dog or a sausage? And yes, I think there is a, quite a difference between the two. Savory hot dog. That was amazing. One down, 14 to go. <laughs> there we go. I like it. Let me try this. Come on, come on. I tried one. What's the dog Memphis, one? Memphis dog? Pulled pork, coleslaw, and or a barbecue sauce. Mm. Mm. I like it. Barbecue. Very good. I'm gonna try this mustard sauce. All the mustard sauce. Sounds good. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. Very good. I like that a lot. I like South Carolina style. So there's a lot of different diversity in the f toppings, the flavors of the hot dogs and the sausages, which we already went through, so I won't do it again. But I will just start by saying I had such a long day of travel. I was absolutely exhausted, but I was excited to actually eat. Let's go, Joel. Let's go, Joel. Let's go, Joel. Come on, so this Joel. one here with all the sauce on it. I'm going to try some Louisiana sauce sauce. Hot and spicy. But it's kind of like a barbecue sauce, I said. Oh, yeah, baby. Mm. Come on, Joel. I definitely get more barbecue-ish than hot sauce. Tastes good, though. I also try their Chipotle. All the Chipotle. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds good. Very good. A little bit of spice on that, though. So this is a really big food challenge. I mean, like I said, we had a total of 10 hot dogs and five sausages, you know, with a 35 minute time limit in order to get that meal for free. So definitely a sizable one. I think the time constraints really do make this probably an expert level challenge, not only with the sheer weight and volume, which was massive, but also the complexity of hot dogs to eat when not a lot of time. I'm gonna try maybe the sausages next. Yeah, I'll see sausages. I'll try this chili cheese dog. Hard to go wrong with a classic chili cheese dog. Mm. I like that one. You know what it tastes like? A chili cheese dog. And then the sausages were actually even bigger than the hot dogs. You can see how much girth they had um, at the front there between the hot dog and the sausage on the little holder. So of course, I really liked the diversity of the flavors of hot dogs, but what I really appreciated was the diversity of different sauces they had available for use on the different tables. Maybe I'll try this jalapeno hot sauce on it. Spice it up a bit. <laughs> 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 Good flavor. Of course the barbecue sauces were on the table because they also serve barbecue here, but just having all those additions and the hot sauces, just you could make endless flavor combinations, which to somebody like me who likes different flavors, you could have a different flavor each bite, you know, by combining a hot sauce and combining a barbecue sauce together all in one. Nacho dog, so tortilla chips with uh, sour cream, tomatoes, onions. I'll try it by itself. Whoa! Sour cream on a hot dog. That's actually really good. Like, <laughs> that really rich pork on it. I know what to expect. That's really, really good. I'll try the habanero. This wasn't the spiciest one. Not just supposed to be spicy. Not too bad. I really like this not too bad though. I'm actually pretty, I'm impressed. And I will say I did enjoy the sauces, especially the barbecue sauces. Um, I love like a Carolina mustard style sauce and they had just so many unique ones, whether you want a more like traditional kind of, you know, brown barbecue sauce or the different, uh, you know, mustard sauce, etc. So no complaints for me. I love the different additions. I loved having all the accompaniments. And I think that's what really kind of stood out for me. You are at five minutes and 15 seconds. 
So on, 5 Joel. 15, guys. Come on, Joel. Let's Let's get get it. It. Yeah, Come on, Joel. About three minutes left. I also will give a huge thank you to the staff. They were very friendly. Thank you to everybody who came out to watch as well. We had a good showing here in Venice. I actually feel so much better eating something, like alive again. I have consumed the most caffeine today I think I ever have in my life in a single day. Crazy. Very good though. I'm really enjoying all the sauces. Like I said, I got so many barbecue sauces, hot sauces. Very, very, very delicious. Uh, now I will try the sausage. I'm gonna try this one here. Kind of the, excuse me, classic brat. A little burnt, but compliments to the chef. <coughs> compliments to the chef. And the cooks, whatever you want to call them. The hot dog, sausage masters. Mustard, sauerkraut. Mm -hmm. Come on, Joel. Ooh, come on, Joel. That's a good mustard. Ooh. Come on, Joel. Really deep flavor on it. Mm. One bite, Joel. Everyone knows the rules. <laughs> Lots of bites today. Put that little uh, mustard barbecue sauce on. But that everybody, that's pretty much the majority of the info. Hopefully my lack of sleep and my incognition will not affect me too much and we'll be able to get this big food challenge win. Let's see if we actually get to try all the different hot dogs and sausages and the different flavor combinations. And at that, hey, while you're at it, I really appreciate you guys liking the video, commenting down below, and sharing the video. Guys, I haven't used ketchup yet. I'll dip this in some ketchup. Oh yeah. That was actually really good sausage. Really enjoyed that. I'm gonna to go with another one of these Chicago dogs, guys. <clears throat> I love this like little peppers they have on here. I don't know what they're called. If you know sport peppers. sport peppers, there you go, guys. Sport peppers. Let me know if you like a Chicago dog down below. Definitely a good combo. A little bit of heat, celery salt, fresh. We're gonna try some Kansas City barbecue sauce. That would be like cinnamon or something. Great flavor. I'll do the other barbecue dog, and then these will all be new. And the mustard sauce goes really well with pulled pork. About 10 and a half minutes in, I think. I still got 20, like 25 minutes. <laughs> About 24 minutes left. All right, guys. Let's try something new. Uh, well, no, hold on. We got chili cheese dog here. Wait, this is sauce? Oh, this is sausage? A hot sausage with chili cheese? Holy <laughs> jump it. Come on, Joel. Hello, guys. Now let's try it. This sounds like quite a combo. Spicy sausage. <clears throat> My compliments, guys. Let's give it a shot. Mm. You're, at 11, you're at 11 minutes and 23 seconds. 11.23. Delicious sausage, guys. Good. Beautiful cured flavor in that. Try this, let me see how hot and spicy on it. This is a spicy sausage, guys. I'm, I'm actually pretty surprised. Get a good burn going on. Mm. Yeah, I'll make you guys wait. Let's go back to this barbecue dog. And then we got the new ones here. And that one new one. What's that one again? That is a mild sauce with cooked peppers and onions. Cooked peppers and onions. Woo. Part of the dynamic. I do like I do like some cooked peppers and onions. Definitely have some air in me though. I got a burp. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry guys, that was a little excess. <laughs> Thank you.
Thanks for coming, guys. Appreciate it. Last Chicago dog. We're at 14 minutes and 43 seconds. Oh, playtime, Joel. Playtime. Come on, Joel. Come on, about 15 minutes. You got breathing in the room. I hope so. I gotta breathe. Who else from Memphis Sweet? Give it a shot. Like, so they got so many options and sauces and flavors. I really like that. Uh, let's do this sausage. Oh, looks like it's gonna fall. There you go. Woo, no shortage, guys. Shout out this mustard, though. Okay. That's a star crop. Just for the ketchup lovers, guys. Guys, you throw some ketchup. Although, so many options, I haven't been doing the ketchup. Let's rock the tater tots with a baked potato. Tater tots, bake them. Come on, Joel. Sour cream and cheese. Very good. Turn out good. It looks good. I see what it's all about. Come on, Joel. Very good. Oh my god. I bet. It's actually really good. <laughs> okay. Put some hot sauce on that, Joel. I have to. You have to. What an interesting combination. Yeah. I like it. I don't know how tater tots would really go on it. But tater tot, it actually really does add like a mm, rich kind of crisp on it. I, I'm not gonna lie, it's a sour cream on, uh, on hot dogs. Probably one of the most unique, but I think underplayed items. Let me know if you ever had a hot dog with sour cream down below. That's really good, good combo. All right, now she'll try some hot sauce. I only have like five hot sauce to choose from, so let's try, um, try a little bit of habanero. We'll go all the way, the spiciest one. Now that was good. The baked potato dog with the ketchup, woo, fire. minutes in the hot dogs and chill. So very good. A lot of food. Let's do this one here. Peppers, onions, y'all do the Mac one for last. I like it. Woo! What was on this one again, my friend? Uh, mild sauce and good peppers around here. Mm. Come on, Joel. Come on, Joel. Come on, Joel. Oh, grilled onion. How is it? Fire. That was a good call. Last hot dog, and then I do some shrapnel here. I'm gonna clean up after. Where are we on time? <laughs> We're at 21 minutes. 21 minutes. 21 right minutes. Now, Joel, let's go. And I'm 22. I'm 22 minutes, guys. I'm not gonna lie, I'm full. It's a lot of food, but come on. We got this. We got this. We're there. There you go. Gonna set the mark. Right there. Gonna set the mark. Enjoy Mac and cheese, bacon, all the above. Joel, set the mark, buddy. Let's go. That's a big boy. Let's go. Oh. Holy mac and cheese. Damn. What's this one called again? Cheesy mac and dog. It is a cheesy mac and dog. It is a cheesy, it is a cheesy mac and dog. There is no shortage of mac and cheese and cheese.
Oh, there goes that. She got the official time. I'm gonna run it till I clear my mouth. I'm just gonna clean up some shrapnel here. Damn, Joel. Good job, Joel. Good job, Joel. Yeah. Nice work, Joel. All right. You are Adam Richmond ain't got shit on you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and anyway, guys, we are officially done. Woo! There, so, woo! Holy right, crap! What's the official time? Twenty-three. It was twenty-three minutes and twenty-nine seconds. Twenty-three nice work, and twenty-nine, bro. and then the other time, whatever on screen, guys. Holy crap! <laughs> That was a lot of food. Like I said, we weighed the hot dogs out. Just the one alone was about nine ounces, and the sausages were much bigger. So, uh, excuse me. <laughs> Truly, comments to the chef. <laughs> and excuse, and and excuse me, guys. I gotta say, I don't, I don't burp like that normally. It's only for the for you guys on camera. Um, I gotta say, that was awesome. I have never. I think like been at a place that's like, you know, hot dogs, barbecue, and it's just so many options. Like that was the coolest thing. Like literally with every single bite, because there was like basically four hot sauces, five barbecue sauces, etc. I could really have like a different combination in every single bite, which I really enjoyed. Huge shout out. I really like this mustard barbecue sauce. I'm a big mustard fan. Let me know what kind of barbecue sauce your favorite is down below. The hot sauce were really, really nice. The chipotle, the jalapeno, and the uh, habanero. Me like I would, the way I would describe them is they're a really nice kind of uh, acidic focus, but you actually really taste that pepper. Like I tasted the chipotle, I tasted the habanero, I tasted the jalapeno. Um, it was very like distinct and it was very obvious what kind of sauce it was. So it's definitely as intended. Oh my gosh, Whew. my favorite barbecue sauce. I think it probably was the, uh, maybe the Kansas City. They're all very, very good. Let's give a shout out to Crave and Venice, baby. And shout out, yeah, definitely shout out. And, 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 shout out to everybody, and shout out to everybody here in Venice. So thank you guys. I much, much, much appreciate that. So that guys, we do complete the challenge. Um, we do get the 15 hot dogs and sausages for free. And I am honestly, I cannot believe how full I am. Whoa, and I tell you, definitely at the end, some of those peppers and spices were definitely building. I definitely feel that. That is for sure. But, uh, nice work, Joel. Thank you guys. At that, I really have no other words. Huge thanks to everybody here, guys. Thank you so much for coming out. Much appreciated. Nice work, Joel. And people say, why can't I wear gloves? Because look, guys, I can just pull this off, and now I can actually touch my camera and not get it dirty. I actually, fun fact, I'll tell you a story another time. I wrecked my last camera lens getting sauce and stuff in it. So I'll tell you guys about that. But that everybody, thank you all. Thanks to Crave here, guys. Really enjoyed the hot dogs. They do a barbecue here. I only really got to try the pulled pork, but they got some brisket, which looks really, really good. Another time, I'll be back. Venice, Venice. But hey guys, floor is awesome. That's it. I've talked enough. So next time, buddy, say happy with how you're happy eating. Until next time, have a good day. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe, yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.